Begin by printing a status page. Press the System Menu Counter key. Press Report and select OK. Press Report Print. Press OK. Scroll to Status Page. Press OK. You'll see Are You Sure? Press Yes. Upon completion, press Exit to Exit. After printing the status page, look for the IP address information here. We will need it later when installing the Mac Driver. To download the latest Mac drivers, go to kiaseradocumentsolutions.us. Click on Support located near the top of the page and select it. Click on Download Center. In Choose an Option, look for Ecosys M 2040DM. Look for the Mac driver. Click on the down arrow key. The download will begin. You will now have a folder named Mac 5 and some numeral. Double click on the folder. Inside you'll find one file ending in DMG. Double click on the file. The file will open up and you will find three additional files. On the left you'll see Kyocera OS X 10.9 Plus file. In the center a Mac driver guide and on the right an uninstaller app. Click on the first file. Go through the wizard and click continue. Click continue again. Click Continue one more time and agree to the software license to begin the wizard installation. Click on Install. Enter your username and password. Click on Install Software. Once the installation is complete, you should see the green check mark. Click on Close. You can either keep the installation files or move them to the trash as they are no longer needed. In the System Preferences page, select Printers and Scanners. Press the plus key and select the IP tab above the printer listings. Type in the IP address from your printer. The IP address is listed on the status page you printed out earlier. Now go to the next line, Protocol, and select Line Printer Daemon LPD. Leave the queue blank and click on Name. Enter a descriptive name for your new printer. Next click on Location. You can leave this blank or you can name a location for your printer. Under Use, select Kyocera Ecosys M2040DN KPDL. Click Add. The next screen will be set up later. Just click OK for now. You can now select sharing preferences as needed. You can also make your newly installed Kyocera printer the default printer, meaning any print job from this computer will automatically print to your Kyocera printer. Now select the default paper size. In most cases, you'll be printing U.S. letter. You have now installed your Ecosys M2040DN printer.